Hey everyone, we're at Expo 24 in San Diego and I'm here at Holy Bros booth. For Holy Bro, just so you remember, it's a Trunco Silver member and I'm really happy to be with Vince today because we're going to talk about really cool products, you got really new, good stuff uh, coming along. And before we get into talking about that, I want to talk about the PX4 Dev Kit because that's something that we've been working, well we worked together yeah, of for a while and uh, it's been a project and a product that has revolutionized everything and a lot of people are using it and I really like that framework so I want to talk about that first before we jump into more Pixel stuff. So here we go. This platform uh, is a very modular uh, PX4 developer kit. Uh, it comes unassembled in the box and uh, how long does it take you to assemble this? Uh, about 30 to 35 minutes for myself. For you, like I, man, for me and mere human, like an hour. <laughs> but if you really know what you're doing, like 30 minutes or so, um, what's included in the kit? So the kits include uh, the GPS. So we use the M10 GPS here, and the flight controller. You have a choice of the Pixhawk 6C and the Pixhawk 6X, and also uh, four motor, six propeller, uh, power distribution, and four ESC, and all, and the frame. Right here. GPS, yes, power GPS. distribution. Mm -hmm. Then one of the coolest things about this is that you don't have to do the routing of the wires. <laughs> they already did that for you, so you only have to assemble those. Yeah, so we make we try to make it as easy as possible. So the whole arm with the motor and the ESC are already assembled, included. And there's no really no way for you to get it wrong if you just kind of look into what goes like into the uh, instruction. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, and when I say we work together, that's part. That's that was my contribution <laughs> because <laughs> I screw up a lot. So I wanted a platform that people can just take over and just assemble it uh, in less than an hour. So I think we did it good. Um, one of the other uh, things that is uh, setting this platform apart is the fact that it's modular. Uh, it has this bay on the read, and then it has this part of here. So you can basically put other components in here, uh, which makes this a very capable platform. That's the PX4 Dev Kit. All right, so now you got other cool stuff at the show. So this is our new Holy Bro X650 platform. It will come with a Pixhawk inside and it also come with GPS. It got, compared to the X500, this is um, much bigger and also has a much higher payload. The arm here can be folded down and it also have LED on the side, much bigger motor carbon fiber propeller and also a, a bigger space on the top and bottom for battery and other peripheral. Can you tell yes. us more about your new Pixhawks? Yes, uh, we got two new products here. Why don't we start and with that one? Of course, let's, let's start with this. So this is called the Pixhawk 6X Pro and what this is, is a is a higher grade version of the original Pixhawk 6X. And inside it has the ADIS uh, analog device IMU, much more expensive and uh, higher grade IMU with, with a bigger acceleration range. And also, we also improved the uh, vibration isolation system inside. Instead of using the traditional foam, now we are using um, a special made uh, material that is silicon based. And it is, overall, it had give a better performance. It raised the uh, resonant frequency much higher. So oh, nice. it won't it won't be running in the same frequency as the drone motors. And, what sort of use cases do you see for this? Uh, all sorts of use cases. You can use it in uh, a big drone, like a big veto drone. You can use it in big, big quads. Even uh, for regular hobbyists, you can you can use this on. All right, this is uh, the Pixox Pixox Six X Pro. Now, my personal favorite. What is this? <laughs> this is the Pixox Jetson baseboard. So over here, we got the Pixar 6X and the Jetson Orin NX, and uh, all connected in internally with a UR CAN and Ethernet switch. And this Pixar 6X is also, this is also a modular form factor that follows the Pixar autopilot bus. So you can remove this and put the, any other flight controller that follows the standard in here and it will be compatible. And this really just brings in a new, um, a new product for machine learning, for AI, for a lot of uh, research development, and uh, I think uh, we're very excited for this. Yeah, I mean, this is a complete autonomy stack uh, running on top of PX4 and PXOC. Um, do you sell these as uh, standalone baseboards? We do. We sell it just standalone, so user can uh, put in their own Jetson in it. 
Um, so we're, it's designed for the Jetson Oren NX and the uh, Jetson Oren Nano, but it's also partially compatible to other Jetson. So we, we sell it just the baseboard or a full kit with the Wi-Fi and uh, an SSD in the oh, back. Nice. Yeah. So it's like an M2 port here. You yeah, got two Wi-Fi. You got two. Nice. Yeah. Wi-Fi, SSD, um, gets an RN, Ethernet, USB 3, the usual breakout on the Pixel board. So you get access to everything inside the Jetson too. So are these uh, the connectors routed from the Jetson? Yeah, they all um, scatter around in other places. So these are all for Jetson mostly, and uh, the one in the front are for the autopilot. Yeah, so for all developers out there, PX4 looking to expand into more autonomy, complex workflows, uh, you can run ROS on the Jetson Orion, hook it up directly to Pexoc through the DDS bridge, and you got your own complete autonomy stack. And the best of this is that you can plug it into the PX4 de uh, de developer kit uh, by Holyreal, and you can have your own autonomy kit in less than an hour assembled. So yes. you can't beat that. <laughs> well, um, thank you so much. I think this is like the spiritual successor of the CN4 baseboard. Yes, definitely. <laughs> so what can we expect in the future from Holyreal? Uh, Maybe even in the future, a more improved version of this, and how we love feedback, and this is our first revision. The and first iteration of the yeah, first iteration. Board. And cool. we also have a bunch of other GPS coming out. We will just release uh, some new GPS lineup with uh, two antenna heading. Yeah, so lots, yeah. Of, lots of new product coming out. Awesome. Yeah. Well, if you're looking for a high quality manufacturer that knows what they're doing, uh, don't look otherwise, look to Holybro. <laughs> and that's it for us today. Thank you, community, and talk to you soon, Ben. Thank you. Bye.